I was born in Slave Lake, Alberta in 1933 and lived a traditional Cree life until school age. I remember a lot of it because that's what kept me going in residential school. Uh, I swore up and down I would never lose my language and I still speak Cree real well, quite well today. And a lot of my brothers and sisters lost their language and they still can't speak it. And you got punished if you spoke Cree, so it was taboo to even say a word in Cree. If the sister heard you, you got to be strapping. So nobody spoke Cree and a lot of them lost their language. 